Welcome back to iMovies Explainer. Have you ever seen iRobot? Today, let's see an iMovie. Ex Machina. Spoiler ahead, watch out and enjoy. Story begins. A programmer Caleb, who worked for a large search engine company. He will be invited to spend seven days on vacation with his boss, Nathan. Then a helicopter took Caleb to a villa that was hidden in the forest. Here, Caleb met Nathan. Nathan was a legend. He was already programming on his own by the age of 13. He's also the founder of this world-class technology company. Nathan gave Caleb two options. For the next seven days, the two of them could drink and indulge, spend the rest of their vacation, or sign a non-disclosure agreement to participate in a tuning test. It turns out that Nathan has been hiding in a secret base all these years. He was developing self-aware artificial intelligence robots. Now he has created the first finished product. He needed Caleb's help to test. If it passed the test, it will be a new peak in human history. As a big fan of technology, Caleb had no choice but to choose the second option. That day he met the robot, Ava. If you just listened to the sound and ignore the appearance, no one would have believed Ava is a robot. Caleb and Ava had some conversations. Nathan was watching through the camera. Nathan closely monitored the exchange between them. After the conversation, Nathan asked Caleb how he feels about her. He thought it was incredible, especially Ava's ability to express herself for Bali. This had overturned his perception of artificial intelligence. At night, Caleb tossed and turned and couldn't sleep. He turned on the TV. He found that the TV was connected to the camera in Ava's room. At that time, Ava was drawing a picture, but the power suddenly went out at the base a while later. When the power was back on, Nathan told him, the base's power supply system has been malfunctioning recently. It was very unstable, but he couldn't afford to repair it and find outsiders to repair it. There are too many secrets here. The next morning, Morning, Caleb found that there was another woman in the base. Her name was Kyoko. After breakfast, Caleb continues to meet with Ava. Ava took out the picture of last night and asked Caleb if he wants to be her friend. Caleb gave an affirmative answer. At this time, the power supply system had problems again. Ava turned into a different person. She lowered her voice and told Caleb, Nathan is not a good person. You can't believe his words before Caleb could react to what he heard. The power came back on at the dinner. Kyoko accidentally touched the wine glass. Nathan was furious. Kyoko was also a robot, but she was a low-level artificial intelligence. Then, Nathan casually asked Caleb, what did he and Ava talk about when the power went out? Because during the power outage, the surveillance equipment was not working. Nathan did not know anything about what they did. After seeing Nathan's attitude towards Kyoko, Caleb started to believe what Ava said. So he did not tell the truth. Before meeting with Ava on the third day, Nathan took him to the arty room first in the whole base. This is the most confidential place. Nathan said he'd hacked into 95 of the world's cell phones and turned on their microphones and cameras. So he can get all kinds of information. Then he put it all into the memories of artificial intelligence. Afterward, Caleb and Ava met. Ava said if she could go out. She wanted to go out with Caleb. She also dressed up nicely, put on short hair, and a flowery dress, looking at this different Ava in front of him. At that moment, Caleb's heart was moved. He had a feeling of love after the third conversation. Nathan told Caleb, the artificial intelligence robot in his fantasy was not only acted and behaved like humans, they even have the feelings and desires. So in Ava's case, she could do the same things that humans do, including the deep communication between human beings. After hearing this, Caleb was once again shocked. In the fourth meeting, the power system happened to fail again. Only then did Caleb know. The light and electricity instability was caused by Ava. Firstly, she wanted to get rid of Nathan's surveillance. Secondly, she also wanted to have more time alone with Caleb. After talking with Ava, Caleb found Nathan. He felt more and more that he had been chosen to participate in the test. It was a trap. This was all planned by Nathan in advance. Nathan didn't admit or deny it back in the room. Caleb saw Nathan barge into Ava's room on the TV. He said something to her and tore up the picture. Caleb wanted to know what Nathan had said to Ava, but Nathan looked like he had nothing to say. He was just dancing with Kyoko in the fifth meeting. Ava made the power outages again. She took out the picture that Nathan had torn up and Caleb was in the picture. Finally, Ava asked Caleb if you want to be with her. Caleb did not give her an answer. When he came out, Caleb asked Nathan why do you want to spare no effort and money to develop advanced artificial intelligence. Nathan replied, the trend is to do it. Even if he didn't do it, others will do the same. It's just a matter of time. Nathan also told Caleb. The next model of the robot should be the perfect product. That's when Caleb realized Ava is also just a transitional product. When the tests were over, Nathan will clear his memory and improve it. When it comes back, Ava is a new robot without memory. After hearing this, Caleb got Nathan drunk and secretly opened his computer. On the computer, Caleb found that Nathan had built several robots before and after, but in the end, they all failed and none of those robots ended up well. After returning to the room, Caleb also began to doubt whether he was a robot or not. He even cut his hand on purpose. After seeing the blood flowing, he was sure he was a human being in the sixth meeting. 
meeting. Caleb was sure that Nathan was not a good person, so he wanted to take Ava to escape. Caleb's escape plan was he first tries to get Nathan drunk, then change the security procedures to trap Nathan, wait until 10 is 0 p.m. off. At that time, the two of them will escape unnoticed, but the first step of his plan failed. Nathan already knew everything, it turns out that he also sensed the frequent power outages must be behind someone's actions. So he privately installed a camera with a battery, that's how he found out about their escape plane. Nathan told the Caleb, don't be seduced by Ava's beauty, say is no longer a simple artificial intelligence. The result of this gradually proved, Ava is a successful advanced artificial intelligence. She has self-awareness and imagination. She can even manipulate the consciousness of others. At this point, Caleb was sure that he was a tool from the beginning to the end. Nathan used a search engine to get Caleb's data. He knew everything about him, including the type of girl he likes, then created the character of Ava based on this data. Ava also knows the preferences of Caleb. Caleb. So she intentionally dressed up as the perfect goddess look that he thought, this is how he easily captured Caleb's heart. Now Caleb knew all the truth, but it was too late. It turns out that he was also worried that Nathan would see through him, so he modified the security system in advance. When the time came to 10 0 p.m., Ava cut the power and escaped from the room on time. Nathan rushed out to stop her and asked Ava to go back immediately. They also fought. Finally, Nathan knocked off Ava's hand. At this moment, Kyoko appeared behind Nathan. A knife stabbed through it turns out that Kyoko was also controlled by Ava followed her orders. Finally, Ava easily finished Nathan. After clearing all the obstacles, Ava repaired herself and put artificial skin over her body. This made her look exactly like a human. When Ava came out, she met Caleb. Caleb was trapped inside and could not get out. At this time, he still had hope. I think Ava is sincere to him, but Ava didn't even take a look at him and left. After coming out, Ava found an excuse and boarded the helicopter that came to pick up Caleb, then escaped from the base and came to the real world of her dreams. So, what do you think Ava will do in human society? Leave comments and subscribe for more videos. See you next time.